It costs 18 health to remove two cards. Kind of a lot of health. Removing two cards is pretty good, but I think I would rather just transform, and that way I don't take 18 damage. I have a Chaos. Why do I have to change the title while you're trying to copy the command? Aww, to say what is happening on the stream? I think is why I changed the title. Defragment or cool headed? We'll go defragment. It isn't a tremendously good defragment yet, though. But defragment has, you know, scaling potential or whatever. I think so far, transforming into chaos has cost me 10 health. So that's going well. Ah, uh, I actually just can't take that. I think a leap. What if I can take it, though? And then we just buy lots of potions. Let's transform a strike. No, wrong one. <laughs> wrong outcome. <laughs> Transforming into chaos has cost me another five health. Losing my mind. <laughs> Asunder. There you go. An actual card. I did get a fairy in a bottle, which I'm abnormally excited about. Panic button? Feels like a panic button kind of spot. Charge battery ever? I don't think so. Ooh. Thank you, Chaos. Draw panic button. Okay. Next turn I get to Sunder. Maybe a beam cell as well, that could be cool. But this looks like lethal-ish. That's too bad. If I didn't draw defend, beam cell's lethal here, right? 12, 13, 5. No, it isn't. All right. It would have been one short. I would have just been even more frustrated at falling one short. This was a good elite fight. You can tell because I still have fairy in a bottle. I even still have fairy in a bottle and have a bunch of other health. Uh, I'm down to go left. With an attack potion. It's certainly a bold choice. Key Marquee! Glad you're enjoying the music.
kind of didn't draw any of my good cards. Oops. I guess I'm probably going to use Fair in a bottle this fight. That looks like basically where we are at. Does Zephyr gallop around the house sometimes like a horse? I don't think that is the word I would use to describe it. Oh. I still have fairy in a bottle. Nice. And my attack potion. <laughs> the zoomies. Exactly. Data disk. Reinforced body. Sure. Okay. Some scaling for later, maybe? Because I will totally be alive still later. Maybe you should buy Panic Button more? It's pretty good, Panic Button. I don't think that would be an unreasonable thing to do. I still have fairy in a bottle. Uh, choices. Twelve twenty one. Use Dex Potion here. Twelve nineteen. I only take one that way. I get to play Chaos or Zap or something? So weird bug going on with the game isn't showing the bottle on my panic button. Well, it isn't bottled, you see. A streamer draws card in opening hand one time. Fight. Still have fairy in a bottle. I think the important takeaway from all of this is that you can never die in this game. You actually just never die. So I'm going to fight this now. <laughs> okay. So far, so good. I think Zappa for Chaos is kind of an indictment of Chaos, you think? Uh, yeah? Sounds right. Maybe. 
like, there's a chance. Well, I used my fairy in a bottle. An emotion chip. A hologram. I don't totally hate a hologram. Uh, that would be a choice. <laughs> Motion chip, not that good against slime boss. I have a lot of focus for floor 12. Do I? Oh, I don't know. Do I? Like, really? I have the amount of focus that one upgraded consume would give if you played it one time. A little bit of the old card draw. Don't totally hate it. We got a rust. And there's a decent chance I just die to Slimbo here. Guy okay, Chaos. Dark Orb seems real good. I think Lightning Orb is like about as good as playing Sunder, so that's not awful. Looks like I might panic button on the right turn. Big if true. Uh, this is also all right, I guess. And then next turn I actually get a pretty decent split. I do lose panic button, but I have hologram. I got a pretty decent split because split I have a motion chip for an extra 12 damage. Sunder. A bit awkward. I also have an explosive potion still. Have y'all noticed that Slime Boss just always attacks me every time in uh, phase two? Sorry, Slime Boss and I have not been seeing eye to eye recently. <laughs> um, I didn't take damage? Not sure that's good. I guess it was fine. All right, GG. Those are not really the cards I was looking for. All for one gets back panic button and beam cell. Maybe I have to take hyper beam. Okay. I hate it though. I will take a runic pyramid. That's our go proxy. It's a no potion act too though. A Turbo Plus is so good here. Wow. That is quite pleasant. Huh, I might take uh, 500 damage this way.
Niin, Kraxinus. Yeah, that sure is all of my health. Birds, what are you gonna do? They all attacked twice. They sure did. One, two. Go, go for the eyes. I'm going to take Force Field. It's because I think Force Field's a very good card. So the question is, do I panic button right now? Mm -hmm. I just take seven. I don't love taking seven though. Maybe there was a line with dual cast trying to kill one. Would have saved seven health. Okay. Cool had it as a decent card. Nice. Channel enough orbs. I like I'm just bleeding out. Deck needs a self repair, perhaps. Take a storm to try to make my uh, force field cost less, but that's kind of all it does. So I don't love it super much. I think a charge battery. Take a charge battery. I will not be fighting elites, unfortunately. I lied. I, I will be fighting elites. <laughs> My mistake. I panic button here? Why I never draw my turbo? When I picked it up, I was like, this card's really good, and then I didn't draw it for the entire act. <laughs> You're not as good if I don't draw it. It's kind of stressful. Where's my card? I'll take six.
This just, like, has to be lethal. There's no way it's not lethal. Yeah, it's very easy. Okay. Ear potion. Another turbo. See, I don't think I need that, but given that I've never drawn the other one, I kind of feel like I want it. <laughs> I'm about to open two more relics and go to a campfire. I have to beat the champ somehow. My deck's okay, but my champ fight is reliant on, like, it's kind of reliant on chaos, I think. A little bit. I could have two turbos at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, Ardivore's not bad. I don't think I take Strike Dummy. But Ardivore is not bad. I'm just going to grab a Rust. I don't think upgrading Apotheosis is worth that much health right now. Good question mark. The key was tied to the bad relic. It was. Things are looking up. My deck actually looked like quite good in this fight. I guess I drew the cards that I liked instead of not drawing the cards that I like. I don't think I can really take Consume. I could take a Recursion Plus. I might take a Recursion Plus, and I think that gives me a champ fight that I can win if Chaos gives me one Dark Orb. Please. Ouch. And it's hard to pass up Strike Dummy because of the interaction with Meteor Strike. Fair. Would actually be pretty good here, Strike Dummy. Just gonna panic button, right? Act 2 home is being bugged is pretty annoying. Will they ever patch this elite? No, I don't think they're going to. I think we might be stuck with it. I think a white noise over a reinforced body. I may regret that, but I still have a force yield that I need powers for. Hmm. Can I win this? I don't know. Got this event in a run today and completely forgot that it even existed. It's not a super common event. Guess it's the old 50-50. Nice.
Well, I'm definitely going for it. My potions are okay. And I have a deck which can win this fight with some draw orders, so... Hello world. Uh, I'm not sure about. In that order is a wonderful response. <laughs> what? Wow. Good turn, pretty good turn. Bird face turn, frozen egg. Okay. I guess I'll take a hallway fight and hope I don't die. The fucking bird is back. I make the semi weird choice to not play charge battery here. I want a motion ship, and charge battery can block for seven here instead of for six. Oh, interesting. All right. Well, I missed. The yeah, Omni. Upgraded Cool Headed seems really good. It is a good card. All my powers? That's all my powers. Power. Nope. Is that ever stack? It could be stack. I have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, and a half. Cards. Okay. I think I'm going to rest again. This fight could be kind of close, and it's just like the upgrade doesn't do that much when I have Apotheosis. How do I value a stack beyond just amount of cards?
Do you want a one cost block guard that blocks for like 15? Is mostly how you evaluate it, I think. Apotheosis. I'm willing to overlook uh, how long that took as a personal favor. Ooh, no dark orbs. How's the spire doing tonight? It's doing okay. Ooh, no dark orbs. Actually, I don't think I've seen a dark orb this run. There's one on a point where it didn't matter. Oh yeah, there was one in like the gremlin fight, I think. And yeah, it um was just unusable. Okay, I remember that now. Oh, <laughs> Everview and Sunder seem like good recycle targets. Yeah, I agree. Oh my god! Please. Okay, thank you. Alright, now we're like completely fine. <laughs> it's just that easy. All right, cool. GG. I guess I didn't need to rust. Oh, well. Is chaos energetically neutral on average? Uh, chaos pluses, yeah. I guess. I am leaking. Oh, no, I'm not. I was taking damage there. My mistake. Ah, we probably just like wait one more time. Again? I don't know. I'm not weak this turn. This feels like it's lethal. Okay. 
I get to play Act 3. I could go Creative AI, Runic Pyramid, Art of War, Bird Face Iron. I could also just take an Electrodynamics. I have an interesting spot. Like, Creative AI with Bird Face Iron. Obviously kinda strong. Do I do okay against Reptomancer and the like, though? I hope so. Alright, let's take it. Uh, I can take Fusion Hammer, I guess. Is there any strategy roguelike? I would consider almost as good as Slay the Spire. You've been thanks for the 17 months. Appreciate it. Almost as good as Slay the Spire. I think there are tons. Yeah. Like, it is a very fleshed out genre at this point. I don't know if I could recommend any one in particular. I have played a lot of Against the Storm. I have played a lot of FTL. I have played a lot of Monster Train. How do I bottle Apotheosis? It seems like the current big question for the run. Also, do I want a genetic algorithm? I think I would like a skim. Now that I have four energy and an art of war. Blotro is good? Nah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I don't. I wouldn't recommend Blotro to people. I have done this in the wrong order. I guess it worked. Wait. Oh, I didn't take genetic. Okay, 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 good. Another? I don't know if I need two. This turn, I feel like I very obviously need to, so I guess I'm happy with what I've done. All your favorite streamers seem to have issues with Bellatro. Well, you probably like strategy game streamers. Did I play a buffer? What is even happening?
Hyper Beam's done very well. Oh, maybe I give it away now. I think it's still relevant against Reptomancer. Give away a defend or a strike. Maybe a strike. Maybe I should give Backpack Battles another go. It does have more content for it now, right? When I first tried it, it felt quite sparse. Why is it fun? You don't understand the fun of that game at all? Neither do I, but... I do think it is a strategy game. So... What if it's good? I already have too many good games to play. That's fine. I will just spend my life playing good games. New storybook brawl game is swapping off of AI art. AI art is so fascinating to me. Do you think it's actually easier to have AI art for your game and have, like, presumably thousands of people complaining that you have AI art versus not having AI art and actually paying artists and not having to deal with all of those people. I can take Cool Headed over Darkness. I feel a little iffy about these super relates. Strength Giant Head is not the worst one. AI art versus public domain art versus no art is a rolling controversy in the TTRPG space. I'm not sure. Hmm. All right, I haven't thought about that, and apparently it's an act of controversy, so maybe I shouldn't comment. But <laughs> let me tell you my opinion anyway. Um, <laughs> I think if a, a DM of mine had AI art in a campaign that they were running for me, a big distinction for me would be I would not feel like an artist you didn't want that. Like, I feel like most artists I know would be, like, fine with that. And so... Yeah. I guess that's my thought. Lith, thanks for the sub. Appreciate it. Now, if it's, like, wizards using AI art and charging for it, like, yeah, obviously, like... Fuck off, wizards. Feels like I am still quite a long way away from this giant head being dead.
What if we paid an artist to generate AI art? Well, we do. The people who generate AI art are themselves artists, or so I have heard them say. And who has a better artistic talent than prompt engineer the broken? This giant head fight is going about how I thought it would, which isn't very good for us. <laughs> I think I've reached the point where I have to panic button, which means I need to kill next turn. I don't have to use panic button. Feels a bit like I should though. I don't know, I might just be able to block here. Ooh, recursion's a big hit. Okay, I think with recursion. Maybe I have lethal next turn. Honestly, still looks kind of iffy. Okay. Let's do this. We don't take too much damage, and we can panic button next turn. And then kill the turn after. I hope. <laughs> this is lethal, right? Imagine if it wasn't. All right, super elite down. Mummified hand. Yo. Decent. Got a big shop. I might buy another Apotheosis. Here's the thing. There isn't really anything else here. So maybe we just buy another Apotheosis. There it is, the dream. Wait, sorry, what? What's the dream? Oh, Mummified Hand is the dream. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't think it's that important, actually. I don't think energy is really my problem. I don't have that many powers, anyway. That's unreal that you tried so hard to come up with a joke nobody else was making, and yet every single other person was making it. That's just really unlucky. Hmm. Uh-oh. I don't think I can play that. Just need shard into searing blow. There you go. I 
I mean, actually, if you think about it, I can use Apotheosis number two to upgrade stuff that Creative AI has uh, generated. That's actually kind of sweet. You think there was some merit to Panacea over Remove? There wasn't no merit to Panacea over Remove. Ah, uh, I mean, is this ever... Is this fine? Is this fine? Full heal stalling off Nemesis seems like a challenge. I don't think it's much of a challenge. It's pretty straightforward, I think. Need to actually draw my uh, Frost Orbs. Yeah. Have we seen orange pellets yet? We have not. Is that enough? Thereabouts? Not quite enough, but I have block cards too. Can't play Storm either. Rude. Oh, I don't have space in hand. Oops. <gasps> Cantaloupe Island! That's the name of the movie. Start the run versus current state of run. Is this even strong though? People get way too excited about full healing in a fight once. Not even that good. You're not excited? Good. Yeah. Keep it, uh, keep it proper, chat. Ooh. Seems helpful. Goodbye, the Nemesis. An incense burner. An amplify. Okay. We're starting to get there. A tungsten rod and a maw bag. Love that. Love that for us. Uh, do I just play creative AI? I guess. Do we get there now? We're pretty slow.
Hmm. Mawbank, great art of war, worst relic ever. What do you dislike about it? Is it the reduced understanding of the importance of logistics in war? Or perhaps it's failure to properly address the air and the sea theaters? Plague attacks give dopamine. Must do every turn. I agree. Nice. I think just fights. I don't think I take cold snap. Thought about it a bit. If fighting is shorter result of victory, then you must fight. Sun Tzu said that, and you'd say he knows a little more than you do, pal, because he invented it, and then he protected it so that no living man could best him in the Ring of Honor. And then he used his fight money by two of every animal on Earth. That, no, that's Noah. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's Noah. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite thing about Twitch chat is definitely its intelligence and uniqueness. That's right. I have two favorite things about Twitch chat. Because Twitch chat is just so great. Don't forget our sophistication. I had forgotten your sophistication, but... That's a good point. I like that too. Do I want... Incense burner on four or five? Probably five. I don't know. Sometimes they don't attack you on turn one. Probably five, though. Dead. I feel like this fusion's okay. I think I'm changing my mind as I think about it. I could use a capacitor. If I get one capacitor, I feel moderately confident about the run. I have very good relics, and my cards are not very good. That's basically how I would summarize this run. If fighting was swa to wizowat in victory, then Uwu must fight. Sun Tzu said to it, and I'd say he knows a way more than you do, power, because he invented it. And then he perfected it, so that no living man could best him in the wing of honor. 
then he used his fight money by two of every animal Owen Oof. And then he shielded the wheel onto a boat, and when then he beat the crap out of every single woman. And when from that day forward, any time a bunch of animals are together in one place, it works. This is why you need to have channel moderation. Otherwise, who knows what's going to happen. I have a very good friend in Rome. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how I feel about jokes about stutters, actually. <laughs> uh, I'm sure I feel worse about them than the other jokes that you've all made. I think only people with stutters can make those jokes. Yeah, maybe. I think as long as it's clear that I'm making fun of Twitch chat. Specifically. Maybe it's okay. If it's mocking Sun Tzu, it's always okay. That's actually page 17 of the Anarchist's cookbook, which I still remember perfectly. I also have a book that teaches you how to have a home birth. Although, I still found it difficult. Glacier seems okay. These relics though and Maw Bank. Hey, don't sleep on Maw Bank here. Maw Bank is not bad here. It's gonna get me like 140 gold or something for the final shop. Your polychrome banana died. I'm sorry, a storm full crotist. Have you considered playing a better game? <laughs> Why am I being so mean lately? What's got it into me? Thanks for the 500 bits, Karados. Karados SA call 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 with 500. Paying a very important tax. Thank you for paying a very important tax. It's really just about Bellatro. Are you saying that I've become mean because of Bellatro? Hmm. Next star looks kind of iffy. Did I already forget what I read out loud? I don't remember any part of the last seven years of my life. Hopefully this is okay.
got a hyper beam, but I would rather not play it. Twenty so far, so thirty-nine, forty-eight, fifty-seven left to go. Whew. Big number. There's thirty though. I guess this is enough. And then I could panic button next turn, maybe. Oh, she's a total of 75. That plus 21 is enough. Yeah. You'll be trying for gold's sake and get sent man and think I hate myself in this game. Yeah. <laughs> Relatable. It does feel like balancing the game so that it's a good strategy game is helpful for making a strategy game more enjoyable for its players. You remember the good old days of Jorbs before Bellatro? There's this, there's this like online thing that I don't understand that is all about people who say that they're positivity people being very toxic. And I find it very confusing because I have never met someone who's like, yeah, I try to like stay positive and et cetera and found them to be extremely toxic, but maybe it's just like not. Maybe they're just like in a different a different space from my positivity people who are like very chill as far as I can tell. Or maybe I just don't notice that they're awful. I don't know. Sometimes I don't notice that people are awful. It's happened to me in my life. Uh, anyway. I guess what I'm trying to say is that um, now that I'm not a positive streamer, I'm probably less toxic. If you do the math. Sorry, if you don't do the math, I got that backwards. The internet makes us at least 50% more toxic than we are in person. The most toxic food that a child can eat is actually actually breast milk from a Twitter feed. There's a thing. Apparently I'm on pregnancy now. I don't really know how that happened, but apparently that's where I'm at now. There's a thing where uh because Toxins don't break down as they go up the food chain. Uh, breast milk is actually very toxic, but it turns out that it is still better for a baby to have breast milk than not. This is my understanding of science. Hold on, how many Twitch followers do I have? Okay, yeah, I can make random claims about science. Uh... Machine learning? YOLO. This? 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 Fine. I could use an apotheosis. Boom! It's almost like I have multiple. Are you checking the number for a high number or a low count of Twitch followers? Oh, if you have more than 100,000 social media followers, you get a medical license here in the United States. 
Can they start asking you your opinions on vaccines? They're like, congrats, kid nanny, on your 100,000th follower. What do you think of vaccines? You were told it was a million? Oh no, no, absolutely not. Ooh. Oh, that's a pretty cool hit. All right. I don't think this fight was in much danger before that happened, but it certainly isn't any danger now that it has. I don't on what title YouTube Jorbs uses when he plagiarizes this run. I can't believe it's not butter. Have you been vaccinated? Five handy ways to tell if the government has vaccinated you while you slept. Uh, huh. Well, Zephyr, why are you here? You already have the food. I gave it to you before I started the stream so you'd leave me alone. You and I really, like, I don't know, we have some communication issues, Zephyr. Do I know if the water is turning the frogs gay? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. It isn't an if, it's a matter of one. The frogs are going to be so much better than before. Awakened One has not had very much chill recently. I was intangible next turn as well. That was pretty rough. Hey! Effort. Hi. What you doing? What would you say is the hardest part of your life, Zephyr? Maybe I should have taken Panacea. I might drink this. X. Like, I need to draw more cards than that, right? Oh my god, we didn't hit this? We didn't hit this. Who was in charge of hitting that? What went wrong? Uh, 
A... Okay, thank you. Jump into stream and Jorbs has two apotheoses. I do. I could panic button here, but I don't think I need to, right? Forty fifty one sixty two. Plus 17, 79, yeah, full blocks. Uh, I could also play creative AI, I guess. And it under blocks by one, which is fine. Although I've put myself in this really weird spot that you sometimes end up in against Awakened One where some powers aren't worth playing. Hmm. Like the ones that I'm generating, for example. <laughs> I probably have to play that. Okay. Let's go amplify biased cog twice and uh, try not to die. Time to play lots and lots of cards very quickly, I think. What's the alternative here? Turbo? Turbo into something? is fine. It's actually kind of perfect. What's a sign of affection, Ergo Proxy? Sorry, if you're leaving, I guess, I guess just go. I guess it's fine. Hope it's uh, an enjoyable time. Okay, more damage seems good.
I think the play is next turn to play two more biased cogs. struggle is that I don't actually have very many orbs that deal damage. Thirty one, forty one, forty nine. Hmm. Kinda need to keep the lightning orb, right? Oh, right, let's do this. Feels like I won. I don't want to kill this turn, I want to kill next turn. And I want to heal a bit more. I should have played charge battery, I guess. Doesn't really matter. Alright, so I have Incense Burner on 4. Actually, I don't even have to kill this turn. can heal a bit more. Good stuff! Alright, I didn't put Sundial on 2, is the only problem. If you could distill relationship goals, it would be that anime. That does sound lovely. There's a primarily YouTube viewer watching a run. Jarbs isn't just rolling the Act 3 boss, it's a rare experience for you. I mean, in the end, I rolled it. Also, I didn't need to heal, it turns out. Recycle? I am somewhat into Recycle. Also, somewhat into Chemex. It is only one reinforced body, right? But still. Or lizard tail. I guess lizard tail's okay. Wait, what the hell? Why is it says burner on five? <laughs> what did I do? What just happened? I don't think I need to recycle. I think I just take lizard tail. I'm very confused. I waited an extra turn to heal more. Oh, yeah! <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> Guess I shouldn't have done that. Uh, that's too bad. Okay, we want to kill that one, and then we can full heal off this one. This is how this fight tends to go. Next turn I can panic button. I 
I could try to save Panic Button. I don't think it's worth trying to save. like actively undesirable to kill this I think. Although I'm just at full health anyway. YOLO. Uh I sure wish I had more good cards than this. Didn't take Chemex, huh? Okay. Stack! Stackers here to win the day. A thing that I don't love is... The way I'm ending this fight is kind of out of control, which means it's going to be pretty hard to put incense burn around the, uh, 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 in the right place. Maybe we chill out and get things under control a little bit. Or just slow down a sec, because I'm dealing damage too fast, I think. Oh, Hacko, it's a stacko. Yeah. I don't know. Yes. I have four loops. Ah, it's too many loops. All right. Uh, pretty sure I can kill whenever I want now. So we kill next turn. I have a lizard tail. I have a loop plus. I'll take it. I didn't get many powers after um I picked up uh Toxic Egg, huh? Got the creative AI mostly. Well Let's fight the heart. Frozen egg, not toxic. Yes, thank you. This is the right order. I could use a frost orb for next turn. But like, honestly, if I don't get one, it's fine too. Ooh. I think that's worth saving. It's okay if I just take 45 here. It's not going to be 45 because I have um, Tungsten Rod. I 
I could save until I draw my other Apotheosis, too. What would I play this turn if I did that? Not very much. I think this is fine. How's it going, old man Biff? Was a very juicy amplifier, yeah. Fun when Amplify gets to do its thing a bit. Getting creative AI down is relevant now. Ooh, very good moment for stack. Is there a void? Okay, I have panic button next turn, but I don't need it because I also have a motion chip. I still have hologram. Nice. So nice. All right. Bang. I mean, it's done. It doesn't really matter what I do anymore. I'm going to be proccing all of my orbs an extra time on a turn where I'm intangible. Cool. It does have the multi-attack next turn. Kind of real. This is fat, greasy base. I appreciate how much of whether jazz is good or not is whether it's disgusting. This is Red Baron by Marcus Miller. Performed by Marcus Miller? I don't know. It's on the screen, though fight. Good game. Oh shit, I forgot the thing again. <laughs> no. I have once again forgotten to record the thing. It's okay. The heart's dead, but uh, yeah. This was a defect run. <laughs> this was really a defect run. I got a Farian, a bottle, in Act 1, so I just decided to go completely ludicrous uh, and fought three elites off a panic button and a fairy in a bottle, mainly. I took two unupgraded defrags, which never got upgraded. Sundra did a lot of work. I got very lucky to keep my fairy in a bottle as long as I did, which let me keep fighting elites. So I got three Act 1 elites. Uh, they didn't give me, like, the most incredible relics. I got a Blood Vial, Data Disc, and Matryoshka. But uh, then I, you know, every relic I found after that is pretty incredible. Very, very strong relics this round. And two Apotheoses to make sure for that I could upgrade all the cards in my deck. GG. I can just open the VOD and talk over it now.
Way too much fucking work. <laughs> That's not what shorts are about. Shorts aren't about quality. Is data disk not a great relic? It is an above average defect relic. Put together my three act one relics were like 